<clears throat> hey you, you, no, you, no, 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 you, you. Faculty council elections are back and better than ever and we want you to put your paws up and take your seat in one of the most exciting organizations at UCT. Student Council is an annually elected student body whose responsibility is to represent and communicate the interest of nearly 4,000 EBE students here at UCT. And there's generally this misconception that the SRC is above Faculty Council, which in reality it is not. Yeah. I totally agree. I think that being in the faculty council, you really realize the, the personal, you know, real nitty gritty problems within your faculty. And being on the faculty council really just gives you, a, you know, the most best position to solve anything out that's, that might be going on within your faculty. Faculty council is number one. It is not just about hoodies, okay? We do so many other things. First of all, okay, you get to like have magazines, like make magazines for students representing their issues, their voices, whatever they want, okay, okay. Second of all, you get to like arrange concerts and stuff to entertain students and entertain maybe yourself if you want, but others as well, obviously you'll be entertained. Thirdly, you get to like have meetings with like lecturers and you get to call them like by their names. I thought that was fun. Personally, I thought that was fun. <laughs> and fourthly, Okay, faculty councils do do serious things, but most of all you get like, you get to see your work in the people that you address. Like if someone comes and complains to you and you're like, I'm on it. You see the look in their eyes and they're like, not. And then when it actually does happen, they'll be like, okay, thank you. And then lecturers take you seriously, and students take you seriously. So I guess it's the time to move beyond hoodies. Well, it's important to have a faculty council because Every faculty has different needs that are um, unique to their own um, courses and that sort of thing. And uh, faculty council is there to make sure that those needs are addressed. So, like with humanities, if you need more than one week to write an essay, um, that's part of what we're there to do. But also just to um, communicate uh, with the goals of each faculty to the students. The needs of being in the faculty council. Are, are, are great. Um, I, I want to talk from my own personal experience. I had an opportunity to discover myself to a level that I never thought I would. Uh, there are things that you will never learn in lecture theatres and those for me are one of the most essential skills and uh, expertise that one should possess. Uh, just to mention a few, I had an opportunity to actually uh, improve my communication skills tremendously. Uh, I, I also managed to see how well I can multitask because uh, being, uh, being uh, like finding the balance between academics and uh, actually the council work has, has been one of the greatest uh, learning curves for me. I've, I've managed to see how I can man, uh, balance the two. And also uh, being able to work in groups. Uh, I think that's one of the skills that one should possess in preparation uh, for, for, for the corporate world and, and um, the life after university. So, so the skills and the benefits are really immeasurable. Uh, it's, it's as if what you, put them, what you put in is what you get out with. Um, so you need to work hard. You, you need to really, really work hard. Um, I remember at first, uh, when I joined the EBE Eastern Council, uh, it was more of uh, I just wanted something to put on my CV. But then when I got into the council, I realized that it's, it's, it's way more than that. I, I, I realized I, and I understood the responsibility that comes with being a faculty council member. Uh, the, the, the responsibility of actually ensuring that we represent students effectively and um, uh, yeah, I know you've got the goods to represent the faculty that you love. Gain access to prestigious events and meetings on campus, make your CV sparkle and most importantly have the power to shape the decisions that directly affect you and your peers. Open up your campus experience. Stand out from the crowd. Just go for it. What do you have to lose? Nothing. At the end of the day, we've added value to our faculties. And we've really given back, as I said, some pride into our faculties. We've resolved key issues that we've seen within our own lectures amongst our own friends, the issues they have, you know, we've really come to down to the breaking down points of how to resolve it. So I think that's the best part about it. And yeah, man, just keeping your faculty happy, just to keep the UCT cycle going, man. True, I believe.
that and also uh, so if you like your faculty nominate yourself get involved Woo! precisely you we want to see you on faculty council nominations for faculty council open <laughs>